check this thing out, guys. So we are currently here at the Pitcher Molly rest area up in Jersey on the turnpike. And look what I come across. Oh my Lord. And just from here, I can already see that the guy's fifth wheel is painted green, just like the chassis. Let's start off from the front and I guess work our way towards the back and around the whole thing. You guys know, I mean, I, sometimes um, if I don't see the driver, I don't, I don't like to get close to the truck because I don't want nobody to feel uncomfortable. Uh, so I, I like to keep my distance and, you know, more or less point out um, what I like about the truck, you know. And to be honest, <laughs> I absolutely love everything about this truck. I mean, wow. Look at that grill, that front grill, beautiful. See those headlights? Those are headlights. I have a set like that at home that I've been thinking about putting on my truck and maybe eliminating, or not eliminating, just maybe swapping out uh, the one piece that I have. I don't know, let me know in the comment section. Should I do that? Should I do like four pieces like that or should I just leave the one piece that I have on each side? This front bumper looks nice as well. I like the bumper I have better. But this bumper looks beautiful and I like the fact that he has those little lights in the bottom with a little bracket. Very nice, very neat. I can't, like I said, to each their own, but this thing is beautiful. I guess it's out of Iowa. Look at that. Details, guys. Look at the details on this truck. So the hub is painted green just like the chassis, like the frame. <laughs> I already saw what he has probably won't be able to see it here but it is a kitty cat kitty cat oh look at his uh his air filters so he has those classic air filters and then he has the three watermelons which i like this um this is something that everybody's doing now and i really like it because it's it's, it's not too much and it's uh it's uh it's nice you know it's just not too much and it's nice it's not uh it's not like too many lights you know it's a clean look seven inch stacks i'm not mistaken that's what that looks like to me his extensions, you see how I have, I have the long extension? Well, he only has like a two inch extension and it's chrome, it's polished. Painted tanks, painted um, air tanks. His steps, once again, beautiful. Those are the covers that looks dope. I love them. Um, I just wouldn't put them on. If I was to put something on like that, it would have to definitely be with boats because the last thing I want is for somebody to take them. Look at that. Tinted windows. I don't know if you guys can tell, but his door handles. When you grab the door handle, it's 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 chrome, but like the actual cover around it, it's white, and usually that comes black as well. The window trim as well. People, that's like an aftermarket trim, and people usually have that chrome. Well, he has it painted white as well. This thing is beautiful, man. Down to the bone. Like wherever you look at it, it's just nice. Oh, back window just makes the whole thing stand out okay so you see his center panel his is polished out mine's is mine's is painted well I've been actually debating on doing that on actually getting one that's polished out I think it'll make the truck look real nice and I like the fact that he has his antenna back here as well see I don't like those mirror antennas anymore that's played out to me that's played out I like the antenna back here I haven't done it because you have to run the antenna through the whole sleeper so it takes time oh look he has as well so these trucks they have the back end like you see how everything is cleaned and shaved off usually you will have your shocks and your airbags so I guess he bought the flip kit and he has all that installed inside I'm not really sure I don't know if you guys can tell but it looks like that little panel there comes off for better access I'm not sure like I said, I'm not sure. Look at the hook, the hook caps. No exposed uh, lug nuts or nothing. This thing is beautiful. Look at his hoses. He has like a big long hose. Once again, beautiful, beautiful. And he has one, two, three, four, five. Damn, he got, well, obviously to make all this to make all this shit work back here, you have to have all those things there. Chrome piece for the landing gear. Very nice. This whole thing is nice. The truck is something different. And then the trailer, pff, that's a whole new, a different ball game. Look at this. Look, 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 look how 
down to the detail this trailer is. His apron, I don't know if you guys can see it there, I'm saying maybe get a little closer. It's green. See it? It's green. <laughs> That's crazy, right? Like who the hell paints that, right? That's beautiful. <clears throat> Look, he has uh on the trailer he has that cover box i guess i guess that's where the lines go like the original lines man this thing is nice obviously his his uh reefer doors are painted white to match the rails on the trailer top and bottom are painted white to match his tank painted white to match his landing gear painted green just like the frame on the truck Oh, let me show you the top of the frame. This truck, I don't know what year is it. I can't, let me see the dash, but I can see the dash from here. Oh, it has a modern dash. I don't know, maybe it's a newer truck or something like that, but like I said, I don't know what year is it, but <laughs> even if it's a newer truck, you can tell like this thing was stripped down to the bone and, and redone because I don't even see like no chip flaw paint nowhere and like the whole chassis is green. I don't even think you can order that. I may be wrong, but lift axle, front and back. Cause I'm seeing the setup in the back as well. It is a lift axle as well. Look at this fuel tank in the middle, painted white, polished ends. I'm telling you guys, this thing is nice. Beautiful. Roadmaster. Hmm. Who makes these tires? He has, look at that, he has, damn, he has one, two, three, four, five air tanks. Well, obviously, to make all this thing work, you, have all, you, gotta, you gotta have all that. He has the center panels. And I like the fact that his center panels don't have lights. I like the ones with the lights. But I like the fact that his center panels doesn't have lights. Once again, the, the top rails are also painted. I think I said a little while ago. Is this a 53 footer? I think this is a 53 footer. What is this? A Great Dane or what is this? I don't know. So he has the... He has all those brand new wheel covers that, you know, the lug nuts are not exposed and stuff like that. Oh, look, he has the center muff flap in the middle of the tandems. This whole thing, man, there's money in this truck. Polish, look at all that, all that's polish. There is money in this truck. Look at this, look at this, look at the ass in this trailer, guys, look at this. I don't even know what brand this trailer is. I don't, I don't see it nowhere. It looks like a great thing. Let's see the door handles. I don't know. But look at the door handles are polished. His doors are painted white. His back panels painted white. Oh yeah, great thing. Look at the thing down there. Um see this is the setup I like right here. You see? I like I like to have on a spread my tandems all the way towards the back so you can have that back muff flap like that. Anything in between, I guess it's fine, but this this right here is what I like. And I'm guessing this gentleman here has a steady route because in order to, to, to build something like this, you have to have a something steady. Look at the, I didn't even notice till now, the frame on and the tanks, the frame on the trailer and the tanks, it's painted green. That thing looks hot, man. That thing looks dope. It's painted green just like the, <clears throat> like the, the, like the, like the, like the truck, you know? So not only did he dump a bunch of money in the truck, he also dumped a bunch of money in the trailer. And to me, I am the type of person that I believe that if you have a nice truck, you definitely have to have a nice trailer as well. Some people don't care for that. Some people they just rather have a nice truck and they don't worry about the trailer. But I think that the perfect combination is both, you know, a nice truck and a nice trailer. Look, he has the back end of this right here all shaved up and he has four lights and it's all polished out as well. The back end, or, or, the, the whole thing is polished. Let's check this side out. Beautiful, guys. This whole thing is beautiful. I, I, to be honest, I mean, I know that we all start to switch up stuff, but there's nothing here. Other than the lights, I think there's nothing here that I would switch up. 
and the reason why I say the lights is because I like the three quarter lights. You guys know how much I'm a big fan I am of the three quarter lights. But I mean, to each drone, right? Everybody has different uh, styles and everybody has different stuff. Look at this. Look at the door hangers or whatever you, you, they call this. Where you hook up the door to. Look at that. I've never seen that. that. That's totally different. I've never seen that. Look at that. I mean, yeah, they look like this, but not so nice like that, you know? Like the shape of it. And then the trailer, I don't see nothing on the trailer, like no dings or nothing. Everything is just like this right here, man. Just talk about money. Very nice. I think that's a 75 gallon tank because it doesn't go across the whole way. I think it's a 75 gallon. And maybe, yeah, it has to be because my dad has the 100 and it goes from side to side. So this has to be a 75 gallon tank. Beautiful, guys. Look, his uh, his handle for the landing gear is, is chrome as well, or polish. Yeah, that's polish, stainless. No, like I said, this thing. Oh, look, you know what I would, something that I would do different? Maybe he doesn't like them, but the the tanks, the, the caps in the tanks, they sell like this really nice chrome uh, cover for them. They look real nice. And looking from here, his dash looks like it's painted white or green, maybe. It looks like white. It looks like his dash is painted white and the steering wheel is white as well. Once again, guys, this whole thing is... The whole thing is just nice. The whole thing is beautiful. You guys can't see it there, but yeah, he has a cat motor in there. It's probably a glider kit. Look at the top. No emblem in the top, and then it's shaved right there. Like usually, some some people would have the thing to grab it. Well, that's shaved. There's nothing on there. His glass. He has the glass that I want with the like the darker bottom end. Something that I want to call out. I don't know if you guys can see it up there, but his reefer right there. It has uh, like a little exhaust, and that's something that I want to do to my to my reefer as well. Even though it's not as nice as this, I want to do it because. <clears throat> the black smoke on the reefer starts to you know stain up the the thing and you have to go there and wash it and clean it in the whole nine yards but yeah once again man i mean to each their own but if you don't like this then i don't really know what people like man you know and i'm the i'm the type of guy that i like to appreciate a nice looking ride like this when I see it you know it's just it is what it is you know so yeah beautiful guys beautiful